Hello everyone. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. If you are new here, I wanted to say welcome to my channel. I like to share a grocery haul every week here on my channel. And this week we have a Whole Foods grocery haul. And as you can see, it is primarily veggies and fruit as I am going to be doing a 60 day challenge starting April 1st. So I will already be in the process of this challenge and you guys will see that vlog on Friday. But for now, I'm going to show you what I picked up to start that new challenge. I'm going back to a plant based vegan diet and I am training for my first Spartan race. So let's go ahead and jump into this haul. First thing I got was some celery right here and everything here is organic. So I do have some organic celery and this is for juicing and also for snacks. I have some green onion. It is one of those FUDMAP diet type approved items because I do struggle from gastritis and also IBS and I've had diverticulitis in the past so I try to stay away from those foods that will hurt or affect my tummy so let's see we also picked up some of these cherry tomatoes and I just like these to snack on but I might also do that pasta recipe just a little bit different I want to try some different cheeses in there as far as vegan cheeses go I did try it with the BioLife feta which was really good but I also want to try it with some more vegan cheeses as well I picked up a bundle of collard greens these are really small but for two dollars I can't beat that it's a dollar 99 they're organic I love it also have some shaved brussels sprouts Okay, they didn't give me the organic on this one, but that's okay. I'll just wash them again. I know they're pre-washed, but just to make sure I don't have as many pesticides, I do like to use my wash that helps those pesticides come off of the outer edge of the fruits or vegetables. And then I also picked up these organic cooked beets. I love beets. They're one of my favorite. I like to put them in salads. I like to put them over toast. Just so many things. I love beets. And these do help with uh, the days I have anemia or have any type of issue where I'm feeling super tired. It doesn't take it away, but it does boost me up a little bit. I also picked up some gala or gala, whichever way you want to say it, apples. And of course, these are organic. This is also for the juice. I do want to make one juice and I do want to prep smoothies. So this is for the juice for the week. I picked up this Primal Kitchen Hawaiian style barbecue sauce. This has been my favorite other than the ketchup. These two are my go-to. The Primal Kitchen brand is very good if you're trying to lower your sugar or if you're on that FUDMAP diet as I'm trying to incorporate into my lifestyle. But yeah, it's also Whole30, it's Keto, all those good things if you're on those programs as well. I also picked up some more of this protein drink. I only get these on the days that I have to do like a 12 hour shift because I'm easily doing about 25 to 30,000 steps, which is about 10 miles, nine to 10 miles that I'm walking within my shift. So I like to have these on hand just to boost up my protein after a very long day. So let's move those up. I also picked up an organic cantaloupe. This was a dollar more. It's $4.99 for this one. And the conventional was $3.99. But I just went ahead and picked up that. Even though I'm not going to eat the skin, you can eat the skin. I have made a melon salad in culinary school. And you just wash the skin and you slice it super thin. And you can eat the skin that way. But I'm not going to. You guys will see me peel that up and just prep it for a nice snack. I also needed a cucumber and this is for snacking, this is for salads and also for a juice as well. I picked up two of these. 
I wanted basmati rice. I like jasmine or basmati. It seems to be the two that I enjoy the most and I wanted something super easy and simple for those days that I work. I'm talking too fast. For the days that I work, I wanted something I can just pop in the microwave or warm up on the stove super fast. So that is why I picked these up and I have two for this week. We will see how they go. I have never tried the Tasty Bite, but I do like the Tiki, they're not Tiki Masala. Yes, it is. It's Tiki Masala Chickpea that they have. And I also like the Madre's Lentils, which the Madre's Lentils are not vegan. The Chickpea Marsala is vegan but I do like the brand itself it doesn't seem to do me wrong so I also picked up one of the Cara Cara oranges I wanted two but apparently it didn't come over because when I checked it only says one so I do have just the one I picked up a lemon for some lemon water and also for some juicing I also picked up one big thing of ginger and this is for juicing. I picked up some bagels and I've already had one and then somebody else had one um, with my Kite Hill cream cheese, one of my favorite snacks. So I picked that up and then I picked up some organic russet potatoes and I just want to bake these off and have them with my Amy's vegan chili and a little bit of vegan cheese on top and that's going to be a dinner or a lunch so i have that and i picked this up for the family because they needed bread so i have that for them so i am so sorry if i was talking super fast in this video i tend to do that and you really can't understand what i'm saying if i'm talking too fast so I'm trying to slow down for you guys and try to, let's see, Nana McPhee, what did she say? She said, no loose vows. I'm trying not to have loose vows. So yeah. All right, you guys, that's it for me for this video. I hope you enjoyed this haul. I hope you continue to stick around and join our village. I will see you guys on Friday for a vlog. So I'll talk to you later. Bye, y'all.